Greetings and welcome back to Realms of Magic. I'm Catherine of Sky, and I asked on the forums about this whole fruit thing. You actually need fruit seeds, not just bits of fruit. Um, and I, um, I asked the dev and they responded within like two hours, which was awesome. And the thing with fruits is that when your farming skill is high enough, you will both get more seeds and more produce from, from your farming efforts. And that includes picking berries off bushes and fruits off trees. And so um, they suggested that I also go to the forest because you could go to these forest tiles and those apparently have more trees with uh, trees and bushes which might have berries. So we should go and uh, travel to those places because, um, well, we might find some cool stuff there and we could even get some more food. So before I do that, I was thinking that I really, really want some stuff. I want to make, I want to make tools. I want to make like a leather working table. Um, the tailoring table would be great. And I probably need a lots and lots of armor. Let me see if I can uh, put any, did we get any leather? I completely forgot. I got so excited about all this other stuff. It's like, Oh, uh, right. So anyway, we have things right now. Let me put some of this stuff in our crate. Um, let's see, what do we not need? It's cloth, probably these hides. We don't need light leather, sheep pelts, uh, these tooth meat fruit. Uh, I'll keep the potatoes on me just in case I need to eat them. Let's put the bucket in there too. We'll put this wolf meat too. And, um, I don't even know what that's for. Uh, the clumps. Yeah, we can send those off. What does this do? I don't know. Oh, this may be throwing out in the trash. I wish there was a way to like, kind of like reorganize this, like a button to click wolf pelt, that stuff. Okay. Book of old gods. Ooh, look at this. I wonder how many pages it is. It's 14 pages. Wow. All right. I will go through them slowly so you can take a screenshot if you like. Um, there we go. Or pause it. There we go. So it's not terribly hard on YouTube to get this. <laughs> okay. There you go. Uh, and I'll probably read it later myself. Let me put this in that box as well. Raw rabbit meat. We can't do anything with this. Rabbit pelt. Rabbit foot. Really can't do much with a lot of this stuff, unfortunately. Let's just put this here. Got straw. Got this. Put our building materials up here. Clay. Go here. Um, I'm going to put these tubes in here as well. Because we don't really need them at the moment. Actually, we'll put that down there. That's okay. And then this is elixir of mining. Probably won't need that anytime soon. And then these rat tails. Don't know what the heck to do with that. Okay. We'll shift that into there. And this is wheat, which we also don't know what to do with that. So here we go. I think we'll put these things down here. Put coal in the last thing. But yeah, I really wish that um, these things wouldn't get out of order. <laughs> oh my goodness. Maybe there could be like a way to just um, remember that area or something. Okay, tin sabatons. We just need two light leather. Well, let me see. Maybe we do have, I think we have what, four light leather? Oopsies. Um, also, I did learn that... Um, these corpses and stuff, they're working on a way to get those to disappear. So that's something that's upcoming. Um, right. So not this, this, yes, right. We want to get tin sabatons armor 20. Okay. we got hands and feet stuffs. Ooh. Should I get a hat? Ah, it only has 20 armor. Okay, let's get the foot feet armor as well. Ooh, pauldrons. 
Oh, it needs, well, it needs two light leather. Oh, if I had a burlap rope, I could make the hat as well. Okay, let's put these feet in. <laughs> We're going to be very interestingly attired. <laughs> okay. Um, what was I going to make? Rope, burlap rope. Oh, it's from this spinning wheel. Whoops. Okay, rope. Let's craft like five of them. Okay, that's enough. <clears throat> okay, let's get our helmet. Tin helmet. <laughs> Craft it. Did it give us a new thing? No. Tin plate, tin chain. Tin candlestick. How lovely. Bucket and candelabra. Wow. That's pretty cool. I'd love a tin hatchet. Oh, we're out of tin bars. No. All right, well, that's okay. We're we're doing good. <laughs> my character looks extremely grumpy right now. Oh my gosh. Well, looks like we have some more ability at the very least. So I think I'd like to go out and... Um, man, it's so hard to decide to mine or go and uh, get... Wait, do I have any water? Oopsies, B and C. There we go. Yeah, we do have two full things of water. Yeah, it's hard to, to decide whether I want to go mine or go and explore the wilderness, but having learned about all these um, bushes with berries and stuff on them, I think I want to go explore and get those organized. But actually, do I have some tin ore and I could have gotten four bars there. Shoot. Oh, well, it's okay. We'll get there eventually. It's fun to craft stuff and get all the things. So here we go. I hope we actually have some decent armor here. Let's see if our professions I have. Um, not not professions, talents, is it? No, no points to spend. Okay, we're fine. How much farming do we have? Level four only. So I think we probably are going to need lots of farming. Wow, milling is a thing too. Don't have any leather working or crafting. Alchemy, no alchemy at all. All right, M. Let's go to the square right next door. I would love to get more movement speed. All right, I'm going to take out my my thing here. Let's also just look for plants. What's this? Soil and root. Okay, cool. Ooh, these are trees. Is that like an oak tree? What's that movement over there? I wonder if this is an oak. Looks kind of like it might be. Wow, this is takes a long time to fill this tree. Oh, yes, it's oak. I got an oak acorn as well. Okay, so let's get out our weapons and kill some of these rabbits here. I think somebody wanted rabbit meat. Okay, take all that. Oh, there's some stuff here. What are these? Flax seed. Oh, flax. We could make linen. What is going on down here? It's really interesting that it's dark, like in this lower valley. It's kind of cool. I mean, that happens in real life, of course. In valleys, it does get darker than uh, above. Let's get these oak trees. I'd like to have a couple of oak trees growing near my place in case the wood requirements are different and we have seen different recipes for oak too so I'm kind of excited about that oh, there's some sand here I think I'll dig that out in fact I might just dig all of this sand out I wonder if I can place things here. Can I build stuff here? Yeah, I can. Nice. Oh, there's some tin right there. I think I'll get it. Wow. There's a lot of tin here. 
I mean, when it's so close to the surface, I really can't refuse it. That's really nice. There we go. I feel like I'm getting faster and faster. <laughs> I am actually, you know, with the mining um, levels, I am technically getting faster. Okay, there we go. I'll put this, I don't know, let me know also um, how you like the overlay. Like, do you like this visible so you can see it? Do you like to watch the professions come up or just let me know. I feel pretty much okay, comfortable with having the backpack showing at all times, um, just so I can see what's going on. Wow, there's two roots over there. That's pretty cool. All right, let's get this tree down. This is still that stone ax, I believe. So it's just really, is it? Yeah, stone hatchet. It's like, oh, a deer. Okay, let's get this off the screen. Attack it! I don't even know if I can catch it. It's gonna run forever. <laughs> you know what? I'll leave it. And I'll, uh, I'll get it later. I may need something like a bow and arrow to get it more effectively. Mining increased. Yes. Also keeping a look underground for stuff that I might find. More tin or whatever. Yeah, but if I could get the height of that deer, that would be nice. Come on, oak tree. Fall. There we go. And I like the realism of like having, ooh, a berry bush. Two blueberries. Four blueberries. Seven. I wonder if I could fire plant, All right. If I, can I hoe this? No. I'm trying to beat it up with the hatchet. Oh, no! Okay, I was thinking it might give me some seeds, but I guess not. Okay, so we're not going to beat up any more blueberry bushes. We've learned our lesson. I had to try it because I thought, well, there's some sand in here. Looks tasty. There we go. a couple of pieces of tin. Nice. This is very cool that you can go to like these different places and mine stuff. It's just, I don't know, kind of cool. Like in Terraria, you kind of have your one world and that's it. And, and even though you can make other worlds, it's kind of not the same as like just traveling through the forest and going to these other places. So I like this. This is very cool. You definitely get the sense of being like in a different area and, and stuff. It's hard to describe what I'm, I'm thinking about, but I hope that sort of makes sense to anyone who's watching. Okay, let's see. All right, let's see what else we have in here. Any more trees? Oh, here we got another oak tree. There we go. Getting this tree felled so we can have more wood. I kind of want to set up sustainable wood farming. What is this? Old berry? Interesting. Okay. Just getting some old berries. Oopsies. Oh god. Oh god. R. All right. Wolf. Wait. 
See, he still does 16 damage. That's just like... Like, my armor doesn't even matter, you know? Huh. Well, that's wolves. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, man. No. Oh, no. <laughs> I wonder where I'm going to spawn. Maybe at home. Which would be really bad. Oh, God, I did. I'm respawning at home. No. Shoot. I need a way to make a bed. I really need a bed of some kind. Jeez. Utility items. Pine bed. Yeah, let's have this. Um, wow, we need a burlap pillow and bedding. Boy, okay. I guess I can. Oh, I have no. I have no materials. None. Zero. I have to go and get them. Got to go back and get them. Drat. All right, well, I guess I seem to have survived a little bit longer with the armor, but still, it just seems very, very bad. Oh. I wish combat was more fluid. Um, I really like the, the combat in, you know, like Terraria and Starbound. This feels quite clunky, to be honest. Um, and I hope that maybe, maybe that would see some improvement. I don't know. Of course I am in the very early stages of the game, but right now it feels very kind of very awkward. So that's okay. We'll, we'll get there one day. Maybe we also should explore that cave there. But yeah, I'd like to get proper armor for the rest of me. Oh, and I, oh, I can't actually, I... I was like, oh yeah, I should have smelted the tin. But I'm like, no, I have no tin. I have no tin. What I should do is take a bed to each of these locations. Or at least locations I think I might die. <laughs> try to try to not die next time. Because this is a long way to go. A really painful way to go. I'm going to collect all this lovely clay. And of course, I'll have to rearrange my entire inventory again. Ugh. That's frustrating. I mean, I like that you can get your possessions after death, but having to rearrange your inventory is not... Oh, I need, I need some sticks and platforms. I'll, I'll come back later and get that. I don't really want to cut down trees right now. I'm going to kind of get through here, find my body somewhere, go into, go into dangerous KOS mode, get out my mace, ready to kill stuff. Oh, here's that deer again. Uh, seems to be bugged maybe on this thing because it can't run up that too, too tall slope, maybe? Okay, dear. Sorry. Alright, we got a raw venison and doe hide. Okay. Let's be very careful. We're hunting wolves. Or more importantly, finding out where my body is. Boy. Let's just go carefully. This is where we picked up those old berries and fire plants and things. And there's some oak trees here, which I didn't cut down for some reason. This is so funky where the tree roots are sticking out. That's quite cool, actually. Alright, so that's where I dug in. Don't know how I missed those oak trees. I guess I was focusing on other things. Here's 
There's my body. Gray. And the wolf died as well? Oh, maybe that was the other wolf that I killed. I walked to the left a little bit. Um, Alright, we have Shemgrok Seed. Don't even know what the heck that is. Two hour growth time? I don't even know what a Shemgrok is. Funky. Clump of grass, fire plant, blueberries, flax. Alright, let's put our stuff back in here. Oopsies, not this one. The other menu, please. Also, that menu takes way too long to transition over to. Like, if you're in an emergency, um, you're going to die. You, like, literally are just going to die. So I'm hoping that the fanciness can be kind of mitigated with, um, like, better responsiveness. Whoopsies. Let's make sure we can swing our whacking thing. Okay, there's this thing. Oh man. Okay, I got this one. Good. All right. And go back to getting killing oak trees. <laughs> uh, let's see how many acorns. I have five acorns so far. That seems like a fair amount of uh, of acorns. I don't know how long they grow. Oh, look, let's see. Growth time. Wow, one hour, 30 minutes. Further growing time, three hours. Okay, so... Might be better to have more of those guys. So there's another wolf over there. Okay, wolf. As long as I kind of jump and he doesn't hit me. God, I wish I had a better weapon. <laughs> this is ridiculous. So that one guy wants some... Ah. He wanted some 10 ore, like iron ore, and then he was going to give me a good sword, he said. So I could possibly take him up on his offer. Certainly is tempting. See if we can find some seeds here. Whoa, what is this? Oh my god. Oh my god! 28 hit. Run. It's gonna follow me, isn't it? It's like, has this run up thing. Oh my god! Oh, it's. Wow, I did not expect it to double back like that. Ugh. I think I've gone too far in this this particular forest. I think I'll go back there and just grab my my stuff. And go. I wonder if that's like two hours in real time. Like real life time. Because I noticed that I've played my character for just over two hours. And we've only had one harvest of food. So... I don't know. Oh my god. <laughs> All the rearranging. Boy. If we could lock this. Maybe, the, let's see if that works. What is this? Oh, is this the refresh? Is that the way it... Okay, I'm gonna try those two buttons when I have actual inventory. I feel like my adventures in the forest have... <laughs> Yielded some interesting things. Painful things. Come on, let's go. Go, 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 girly. There's a sheep. Okay, I'm... Kind of glad I remembered where I'm gone, but man, yeah, you need a, be a bed to, to really explore these places without wasting too much time. Alright. We're getting somewhere. Maybe. 
All right, let's go. It is a lot more pleasant in the daytime, though. Wow, this valley is still in shade. That's kind of cool. I've read about some, uh, there's some villages in Swiss Alps and stuff where they literally get no sun time. And so scientists have actually built gigantic mirrors on the, the um, mountainsides to reflect sun into the towns, which I thought was kind of interesting. Long way to go. So obviously our farming skill is not high enough yet to get seeds from any of these berry bushes and stuff yet. So, but that's okay. We'll, we have our potatoes and things and we'll hopefully kill some more rats so we can have rat on a stick, shish kebabs. Come on. Here's all the wolf deaths. Man, that boar is really dangerous. I'm going to pick up my stuff and go home. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get my stuff, take all, and go home. Yep, I am not chancing anything else. I'm just taking it all with me. There we go. Quit while I'm ahead, you know? <laughs> I'm just going to put my stuff here the ores in the bottom instead of moving all this stuff around. Okay, cool. I have very little money, which is unfortunate, but that's okay. There we go. We're making our way back home. Let's put the torch away. We got a fair number of seeds. We got some flax. Well, it's two flax seeds. It's not a lot, but it, it'll start us out. It'll start us out. That's good. Yeah, I put the seeds in my inventory there. Let's see, blueberries, fire plant, clump of grass, old berry, shemgrok. Shemgrok seed. No idea what a shemgrok is, but it could be fun. It could be interesting. Now, there was something down here, as I recall. Oopsies. I should use my three button instead. Let's see. Ah, yes. Okay, we had some tin down here. Let's see. We've got 13 coal. Could certainly use some more coal and we'll get the rest of this tin as well. This will really do us good when we're going to make some new stuff for ourselves there. Maybe we'll get a whole set of tin armor. That would be really nice. Oh, there's more down there. Look at that. There's at least coal down there. I don't know what else is there, though. All right, let's get out of here. M. There we go. <laughs> I wish there was a little icon indicating that this is our, or something, or maybe you could put an icon somewhere to indicate your home place. Because we don't actually have to live here, I don't think. I think we can move. We can go anywhere we want. Let's try to whack this sheep. Because there's no sense in, like, I don't think we can have herds of sheep or anything. Oh, wait. We can fill our water bottles. Okay, and put them in my inventory. You know what? I could um, explore this place. Yeah, why not? We could explore this place, get some more stuff. There we go. I'll also get all this coal because I, I have a feeling we're going to be doing a lot of mining in the future and now. So why not just pick up some coal? 
That's mud and stone. Don't need anything really but clay. Some salt. I'm hoping to find some really nice rats in here. There we go. Lots of lovely tin. Cool. 44 pieces of tin so far. Okay, there's our platform back. I really like this having a torch thing. Like, you don't have to think about having torches everywhere you go. Like, I know that was always a problem in a lot of other games that I've played. It's just constant torches everywhere, you know? And it's good for marking your way, but like in certain situations, uh, like this one, I feel like we may never even come back here, ever. Just because it's, um, you know, we might mine it dry kind of thing. So there's really no point to coming back. And other than having to pick them all up, you know, you just travel with your, your light and you're good and life is better. Oh wow, there's lots here. Lots to see. There's some copper as well. I think I'll pick that up. Here we go. Oh my goodness, there's a whole bunch of stuff down here. Let's see if it gives us additional light. If we put one here. It makes it brighter. That's good. There's a really nice coal seam down here, isn't there? You know what, maybe I'll mark this spot as a good spot to come back to. Because I don't need that much coal right now. Actually, I might. I actually do need that much coal, never mind. I have 33 of that, and I've got 62 of the tin ore. I'll stay this far away, I think. Just get it from afar. So I don't have to go back. Oh, there's some copper too. We need to go one to the right, looks like it. to get all those bits of coal there. Nice. Lots and lots of mining. I really hope we can get an upgraded pickaxe soon. Maybe when we make all of our armor and stuff then we'll get access to better, better things. I'm hoping. Okay. There we go. Got all of this, so... Okay, got that thing there. Should grab some of this as well. It's nice, tasty coal. Oh, I didn't even need to take that bottom block, I don't think. Oh well. It's okay. I'm just kind of used to like mining it all out because I think in other games you had to have, you know, a way physically for the ore to get to you. Um, but this one, it's like you could even get it behind walls. It's quite fantastic. I want that as well. It's a little bit of copper there, but really not much. I really want some... There's a lot of clay. Just grab this clay. I don't know what we'll need salt for. I have a little bit of it. I wonder if it's for like salting meats and things or some other particular thing. Oh my god, wow. 
Hello, mother load of materials. Wowie, wowie, wow. Mining has increased to 12. That is awesome. I'm gonna put like a catchment thing there <laughs> just in case it falls. Wow, I've reached level six. Another talent point earned. Let's see, I think I can go up here. Wow, this is so much tin. This is good. Excited about this. There we go. Come on. These platforms are a little bit tricky. It feels like I have to kind of like get them maybe underneath or something. Wow, look at all that copper. There's a ton of copper here. Let me just grab this. I feel like that's probably the next um, ore that we're going to deal with because that's usually how it is tech-wise in certain games. You know what? Maybe I couldn't get that platform because I was mining it with the wrong tool. I have to try that. Because I think I just clicked dragged and maybe it wasn't the hammer that chose it. Maybe it was just this pickaxe. Let's try that again. No, that's definitely the hammer. And it's just not coming apart. Okay, there it goes. Let's see. Can we... Wow. There's stuff going on here. There's a dead person. Leroy's corpse. There's pants and... You can take all his stuff. I would like to kill these rats, though. You know what? Let's make a battle arena. <laughs> Let's just add some lighting here real quick. Because I want to kill these rats. Okay, got one hit on me. Oh my god, there's so many of them. This one's not giving up easily. Okay, so they go into the corner to kind of die, looks like it. Oh boy, I have no more space. Um, let's just put some... Um, let's see, minor shirt. Let's see. I don't have what what is this for so that's for shoulders I think pants shirt I could put this on as my clothes I don't know um raw rat meat let's just put some of these things up there um tin pickaxe do I have one of those yes I think I do I need a hatchet I have a tin shovel. Oh, tin axe. Oh, yes. Oh, hold on. Five to seven, five to seven. Oh, it's not like a, a hatchet, though. Darn it. Minor helmet. Do I have the fancy helmet? Oh, yes, I do have a fancy helmet. These are like, I think these are just clothes, right? It's interesting that it doesn't allow you to just put it as a vanity thing there. Kind of unfortunate. Um, oh wow, I don't even know what to do. Uh, you know what, I'll just put these extra bits up here and I'll know to sell those. Put them in a special box or something. I just want to loot these rats, really. Okay, so let's open this. Take all. Take all. I think I still have to kill that one. Still standing. Whoa, hello! Bit me. Dang it. That's unfortunate. Poor guy died. Oh well. Not much we can do for him now, unfortunately. Alright, we'll grab some of this 
ultra fun stuff here. While we're here, might as well. Hopefully we won't need to mine coal for a good long while. But man, we already have quite a bit of copper ore. 29, now it's going to have 30 pieces. I don't know how what the, the ratio of smelting for copper is, but that should make us a fair number of bars. And then of course we have 83 tin, which is fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Very excited about that. We'll be able to make pretty much everything we want, including extra nails for other items. Um, for some of those advanced crafting stations. So I'm pretty excited about that. Wow, mining 13. Oh my gosh, there's even more down here. I think what I'm going to do is just grab this tin real quick and then we're going to head back to the home. Head back home. So anyway, I think this is a good place to wrap up. I'm just going to get a little bit more of this coal uh, and then I'm going to call it a day and go back to back home. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other. And I'll see you next time.